to improve your ability to hear S3, S4, and the murmur of mitral stenosis, have the patient roll partway onto his left side, which brings the left ventricle closer to the chest wall. Then recheck the position of the apical impulse and place the bell lightly on it. If the patient had an audible S3, it would sound like this. Now, notice how the third heart sound disappears when the bell is placed firmly on the chest wall. Listen again with light pressure. Firm pressure. Pause periodically to allow the patient to breathe. Listen for the high-pitched diastolic murmur. If the patient had this murmur, it would sound like this.